Frigida, we've travelled a long way to come see you and specifically to learn all about the chow mein sandwich. For me to explain, you have to try it. it smells good. <laughs> Just twist on that on top. This is Soul Food, an American journey through the Chinese kitchen. I'm Gerald Tan, and right now I'm tucking into a fable fixture of Chinese takeouts in New England, the chow mein sandwich. Mm. I could not finish that whole plate. It's massive! I had some customer order two in one sitting. About an hour south of Boston, where the state of Massachusetts borders Rhode Island, lies Fall River. Flecked by a harbour and abundant water to power textile mills, the city emerged as a cotton manufacturing centre during the Industrial Revolution. Today, the pace is much slower, but this picturesque community draws Epicureans from afar, sniffing out a culinary novelty. That quest leads to Mi Sam Restaurant. What is the Chow Mein Sandwich? Chow Mein Sandwich is, is our local favourite. Uh -huh. And it's, what it is, is a, in a hamburger bun to mm -hmm. start with, and then we throw some uh, crispy fried noodle right here. We go to extra little bit um, trouble to heat the noodle nice and crispy. So let them drink. So, and then as your choice, your, what you like, you can have um, pork, you can have ah. chicken and a shrimp and beef, right? How about we're gonna mix a beef okay. uh, with, with pepper, all right? Now put that on top. Okay, you can leave that on. On here. And then turn on the stove right here. So when they get heat up, mm. so then you pour it on here. Okay. Right Just over it? Over it, yeah. No. Let's Noodles see. Yes. on bun. Just, yes. Double right. carb. Yeah, okay. <laughs> The noodles start out brittle, but soften once coated and coaxed by generous lashings of gravy. This viscous heap is then topped with a final flourish. Look right here, a little you know, up a bun. There's some people never, never tried before, and they actually use the finger to pick up. I said, no, 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 no. It looks like it'll be a big mess. <laughs> you start your fault because. What, why they use, uh, put a bun on there? Mm -hmm. There's a lot of people like, just like you eat spaghetti, you, you order garlic bread. I never thought about that. Yeah. And, um, and those days, on Friday, we used to have line waiting all the way around the building. Just for this? Fall River is based on a lot of factory. Mm -hmm. It's uh, the textile industry in Fall River. So they, most of the worker they had like half an hour for lunch. Right. So some people, they will order the chow mein sandwich. So it began with factory workers then? Yes, yes. A really filling, hearty meal. Mm -hmm. Quick, mm -hmm. convenient. I mean, yes, and, and, and it's reasonable. Reggie and I travelled hundreds of miles mm -hmm. and I waited a very long time to take my first taste of this legendary <laughs> piece of American history. It's true, Re really, it is. All right, bottoms up. Okay. <laughs> bon right. appétit. Okay. It's kind of incongruent. It's crispy, the noodles, mm -hmm. but it's bathed in this lake of sauce, as you mm -hmm. can see. So it's also soggy in some parts, but also crispy. Punchy, yeah. Punchy, yeah. A humbling but happy realization sets in when something that sounds so wrong tastes this good. Mm -hmm. Double carp goodness 
and robed in a nice thick sauce, your recipe. Mm. And to call it a mere crowd favorite would be doing it a disservice. Uh, people travel from New York, one of them from Connecticut, every month, at least twice a week. Twice. We have one from Alaska. We have one from Tokyo. And I said, how do you find us? My little tiny place, how can you find us? They say, we look you up in the internet. And they say the weirdest food in the US map. Mm. <laughs> That's what they find us. All right. <laughs> Weird, perhaps, but certainly worthy, such that Mi Sam restaurant and its signature dish are part of the Smithsonian's National Museum of American History collection. For a lot of people of Fall River, this is the dish they're very proud of. It's something they grew up with. Right, right. And a lot of um, schools serving chow mein sandwich as lunch in so the it's, menu. It's part of the school lunch system. Yeah. Again, that shows just how integral it is to yeah. this community. Right, right. Been here now? I've been here 50 years. What do you love about this? Well, you learn a lot. Even though we, we cook every day, you still learn from different people. But you have such loyal customers here. We do, we do. And you're so good with them. Well, we try. What do your customers mean to you? They're like my part of my family. It's such a comfort feeling. Mm -hmm. if you make friends and, and beyond friends, it's like your family. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm.